So today we're going to be making a unturned dedicated server. What you want to do first is go to Steam, put unturned properties, local files, browse local files, get unturned, create shortcut drag it to your desktop you can exit out that and steam you can go to properties and go to target what you want to put here is um the server codes so the server knows what to load up this is mine you can use it, but I'm going to leave a list in the description so you guys can make your own. And you can have the map, the difficulty, the sync, PvP, and the port players. And you're going to want to put SV at the end of it so it knows what it's doing. Click apply and OK. After you do that, you're going to do command prompt, then type IP config, click enter, then find your default gateway and go to Chrome and enter it in. After you go to Chrome and enter it in, it will ask you to log in. You can look up your router's default password and username if you don't know it. Anyways, you can go to port forwarding. Um, you're going to put a new one, but I'm using one I already have. You can call it whatever you want. Do tcp.udp and do the port 25444 or use any port you want, but this is the default one. And for right here, your IP, go back to the command prompt and it will be your IPv4 address. That's the IP you're going to forward. Click apply. And then you're going to run the server. It might say Steam not found, but that doesn't matter. Then it'll turn black or gray, whatever. Minimize it. And go to here. And type in IP in Google. This is the IP people are going to join off of. So you give this to your friends or whoever, and they put this in, they will join it. And if you want to join it, you're going to open up your unturned, not the dedicated server. You'll click play and connect, and type in localhost. And click connect and you will be in that server and anybody else can join it and that's about it you can't kick people out of the dedicated server or ban um, I think they'll be adding that soon but anyways, that's how you make the dedicated server. Goodbye.